Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I'm it's going to be a part of my cleaning out situation in my room. I'm not moving out, I'm not going anywhere. It's just the fact that I feel so unmotivated. Like for the past past like week, I think it's because of my room. I just think I'm just like bored of like the whole setting of my room. So I, and I just kept on saying to myself that I have too many things in my room. But today is a Sunday. Usually what I do on a Sunday, I would study. I would clean out my room. Just like normal cleaning. I would try to hang out with my sister or my friends. But because I'm not doing anything today and the weather is horrible, I decided that I want to clean out my closet. I don't know how long this video is going to take for me to film. I don't think I'm going to finish everything today. My closet, I would say, is kind of organized for like winter situation. We have like sweaters at the top and a t-shirt with some cropped sweater and then pants which I low-key feel like I don't have enough pants and then I have a lot of like coats and just like little things and then at the top it's like a big bag of just like like just like stuff I feel like I have so many like stuff that I don't wear like I haven't been shopping at all I think last year I shopped probably like a few shirts and a few like a few dress and that's it. I don't even buy that much stuff. I do like think that shopping is fun if you have money, but I don't have money and I would rather save those money for food. Yeah, so I don't really have new clothes at all. You no, know, if I get rid of a lot of stuff, then I feel like maybe I deserve to go shopping and get new stuff for my closet, but I really don't think I have space. So these are the stuff that I'm keeping for sure. So it's around the same amount that I started with watching Linda Sun because I want to get more into workout and she is so motivating. This is the stuff that I'm going to go through. I don't know if I'm going to keep them, donate them or sell. So I just put it on the same pile and I think I'm going to try them on. I have some time so I think I'm going to go through my jackets and my dresses that are being hung next to yeah the messy part. So this is the final result for the shirt parts. So I have an extra space on here, so that is amazing. So here's the result. I don't think that it's much different than before. It's kind of the same pattern with like the dresses all over here and then jackets, but I decided to do more like color coding over here. It's a progress. It This part does look better, but the coat part I think is really clamped because I do have to organize her like as you guys can see. So I think tomorrow the plan is to do the two organizers and possibly at the top. I don't know about the top because it's all like summer clothes. It's funny because I have that like that whole big organizers are all like purses. It's a lot but I don't use a lot of purses. I use like a backpack and I use like one or two like the whole thing. So that's kind of bad. I think I'm if I can organize it properly, maybe I can get the chance to use more purses. I got rid of like a bag of clothes, so I'm pretty proud of that. 
Alright guys, so this is the next day. I have an hour and a half. So today I'm just going to go through the two organizers like I talked about. So mostly purses and my personal kind of thing situation. And then if I have time, it's going to be the shoes. There's not a lot of things to organize for the shoes, mostly just to see what shoes I want to sell and get rid of. But yeah, that's the plan. So last, last part of the clock. All right, so this is what I have for the organizers. I'm pretty proud of that, but it, I don't think it's gonna be finalized yet, just because I have a lot of purses, as you can tell. I wanna have this whole thing as purses, but I just wanna keep one organizer, so I don't have space, like I don't need to do anything here. So I don't know if I'm going to buy like a basket to put like my bras and like my socks and put it on like the rack here, or, I don't know yet. Alright guys, so that's a little transformation that I did with my closet. I know it's not that much of a difference, but I think at least getting the chance to go through everything in my closet, it's just nice to see, like get rid of some stuff. It's not as cramped as the one before. It still is a little cramped in there because of all the clothes. And I'm sure it looked really cramped because of the top shelf with all like my summer clothes. But I am really, really proud of myself for doing that. I got rid of one bag of stuff with almost everything. What I need to do is just going through it and see if I want to donate every single thing or I want to sell some stuff. So if I decided to sell some stuff, I might post it on Depop. I never post anything on Depop, so I will see. Maybe you guys should go and do a little closet clean out. I know it takes me two days and for today, as you can see, like it doesn't really have to take that long for you to do it. You can do it within like 30 minutes or an hour. You don't have to do like extreme closet clean out like I do where I just go straight and do it for like hours. You can just do it like within like 10 minutes or 15 minutes and it's kind of a nice way to like get out of your phone. That's the one thing that benefits me the most. Uh, maybe this is an another activity that you can do to restart this 2021 with a better energy. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. I never say that, but I'm going to say that now. Thank you so much for watching this video and thank you for all the support you guys give me. It's crazy how much I've grown and I hope you guys are staying safe with the whole situation. I know situation is getting better and worse with the whole like second wave of this coronavirus. I will see you guys in the next upcoming video. Peace.